what's up guys in today's video i'm going to show you guys how you guys can get yourself permanent fruits from the blocks fruit gacha yes guys after you do this glitch any fruit that you got from the blocks fruit gacha will become a permanent fruit guys literally a permanent fruit so yeah in today's video i'm basically going to show you guys how to do this glitch so yeah guys let's get on to this video so the first thing you're gonna have to do is basically come to the first scene so this glitch only works in first C guys so basically come to the first C and come to the pirate starter area now once you're here all you guys can do just go ahead and set your home point over here just like this now after you have set your home point go ahead and go over to middle town and interact with the blocks with deal over there so uh, yeah if you guys don't know there's another blocks with dealer behind this mansion so all you guys can do just go ahead and go over to that dude all right and we are here now once you're here all you guys can do is just talk to this buff food deal right over here click on continue open up his menu now after you've done that all you guys can do just go ahead and go to the last fruit that is not a permanent so uh if you guys have the leopard as a permanent do not click on that click on dragon and if you guys have a dragon as a permanent and leopard as a permanent go ahead and go to spirit and basically like that just click on the last fruit that is not a permanent so the last fruit that is not a permanent for me is the leopard fruit so i'm basically gonna click on view on that now click on the robux icon just like this now click on cancel, cancel, exit, just like that. Now after I've done that, all you guys can do just do the same thing to the uh, like the uh, marine star area blocks with dealer too. Just go ahead and go over to the marine star area, just like this. And once you're here, all you guys can do just talk to this guy right over here. Continue and after that all you guys can do is just do the same thing last fruit that is not a permanent so yeah Click on the robux icon just like this and click on cancel cancel exit just like that now after I've done that all you guys can do is just teleport back to the pirate starter area so I'm basically gonna use my home point Now once you're here all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the block suit dealer and basically do the same thing to him view robux and click on cancel cancel exit just like that now once you have done that all you guys can do just go ahead and go over to the jungle area okay so basically fly or take a boat over to the jungle area all right i'm getting close to there just a little bit more and i am there now once you're in the jungle area all you guys can do is just first off take a quest guys any quest will do just uh, all you guys can do just complete it that's all you guys can do guys okay so uh, yeah now basically get yourself a quest i'm just gonna get the gorilla swan right over here wait i want to see if the gorilla king is here so i can basically kill the gorilla king yeah the gorilla king is here so i'm basically gonna kill him all right take the quest gorilla king confirm just like that now all i gotta do is just kill the gorilla king and just like this he is dead now after i've done that all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the uh, like the adventure once more so basically fly and go ahead and go to the adventure fly or basically walk so yeah so basically take any quest that you like i'm just gonna take the monkeys one right over here click on confirm and get yourself the quest now i guess what i do is just complete that quest so i'm just gonna kill these monkeys right over here all right is that it okay now i gotta kill one more All right, now after you've done that, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the adventure once more. Now click on this guy, take the same quest that you took earlier. Click on confirm. Now you guys can do is just basically abandon it. Just like this, click on track on your current quest. Now after you've done that, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go to the blow through gacha. Now once you're with him, all you guys can do is just click on this guy. 
click on all right click on random fruit do not click on buy guys okay now you guys can do just click on never mind just like this open up the menu again click on all right click on random fruit now reset yourself while you have the screen just like that now after you've done that all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to any place where there is a boss so uh, i basically killed the boss over here so i'm basically gonna go over to i'm guessing the snow biome why not so yeah i'm just gonna change my fruit to a faster fruit the, um this fruit is super slow so yeah i'm just gonna take the portal fruit right over here all right so yeah Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and go over to um Volcano, why not? Let's see if we have the boss in Volcano. Okay, Admiral is there. Okay. I am fighting for my life right now. Alright. Okay, he is immune to physical attacks, so I'm just gonna do this. Just one more. Alright, now after I've done that, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the uh, block suit gacha once more. So I'm just gonna use my teleport over here. Go ahead and go to the jungle. Just like this. Now, once you're over here, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the block suit gacha. Click on this guy. Alright. Okay, like this, click on all right, click on random fruit, and click on buy right here. Just guys, now you need to have enough money to buy yourself a fruit. So just like that, so as you guys can see, I got the smoke fruit. So if you guys have a permanent fruit equipped right now, all you guys get to is just eat the fruit. So if you guys don't have permanent fruit equipped, it really, like, why can't I say equipped it? The, if equipped, all you guys get do is just skip this part, okay? Do not eat the fruit if you guys don't have a permanent fruit equipped. So I have permanent fruit equipped right now, the portal fruit. So I'm just going to eat this. And as you guys can see, now I have the ability. So, uh, yeah. Now, I guys gotta do is just basically complete a quest with the, uh, like, the fruit that you ate. And if you guys, uh, like, do not have permanent fruit equipped, all you guys can do is just, just complete a normal quest, guys. Okay? So, yeah. Alright, so I'm just gonna take the gorilla sun right over here. So, all you guys can do is just complete the quest now. Alright. I think this would be easy with this. Wait. Oh, okay. It's been a long time I've been waiting for you. Uh, I got my feelings up and it's just This is super slow. Alright. Come on. Alright, now after I've done that, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the fruit gacha once more. Alright. Now, once you're over here, all you guys can do is just click on this guy. Click on alright. Now, you guys can do is just click on random fruit again. Now, click on buy again. So, he should say you have to wait to, uh, to buy another fruit. So, yeah. Now, after you've done that, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to the, like, the pirate star area once more. Just like this. Now, once you're over at the pirate starter area, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to items. 
and basically take uh, like a fruit that you don't need so um, I guess I don't need the flame fruit so uh, yeah I'm just gonna take that so as I said before earlier if you guys had like a permanent fruit equipped it, all you guys gotta do is just basically eat the fruit that you got right now and uh, if you guys didn't have permanent fruit equipped it earlier all you guys gotta do is just basically skip this part too guys don't eat any fruit if you guys do not have a permanent fruit like equipped it earlier so uh, yeah I'm just gonna eat it because I had like the portal fruit equipped it earlier Just like that so as you guys can see now I have flame now I guess I do is just basically like complete a quest with uh, like the flame fruit so not the flame fruit basically the uh, fruit that you like ate and so if you guys uh, didn't have permanent fruit equipped earlier and you didn't eat the fruit all you guys can do is just basically complete a normal quest just like this so yeah basically just complete a quest guys okay so yeah I'm just gonna complete it All right. Okay. All right. For some reason, I don't even have uh, the memory of uh, like uh, getting mastery in this fruit. For some reason, I don't even know if I got mastery in this. So yeah, now after I've done that, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to middle town. So I'm just gonna use the fly of flight thing right over here. Oh my god, this is so slow. Is it slower than the dragon? I think so, right? This is slower than the dragon. So yeah, all you guys can do is just basically go ahead and go over to the block to gacha in the back of this mansion. Alright. and talk to this guy click on the last fruit that not permanent click on that click on cancel cancel exit just like that now you're basically done guys now you guys can do just wait until the block fruit dealer shop refreshes so basically the normal block fruit dealer shop all you guys can do just wait until it refreshes and after you've done all those things, all you guys can do is just get yourself a fruit from the block suit gacha. And after you've gotten it, all you guys can do is just go ahead and go over to like the uh, like the block suit dealer and uh, basically look at the menu, and you should have that fruit as a permanent. So yeah, guys, that is basically it from me. I guess I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye bye. Don't try to tell